Welcome to this video. In this video, I am going to explain how to attach drawings, images and PDF. Already opened AutoCAD. Then click on this insert. Here so many options are there. We are going to use the reference method. Here we have attach clip adjust. So click on this arrow. Then you can get this tool palette. So this is external reference tool palette. Here already opened our drawing is here then click it here from here we have see several options attached dwg this is the autocad file attach image it's jpeg png bmp like that then pdf always we use this drawing image and pdf so in this case i'm going to explain these three types other things are point cloud we can insert from point cloud first we are going to attach a drawing so click on this attract here we have to browse where is our drawing is placed here drawing one is placed this desktop one so i am going to attach this drawing one to this drawing these two are the same name so we can't use like that so we have to rename it drawing ref so i am going to use drawing as reference file click on it here then open here we have some several options to attach external reference first we have we can change the scale by clicking on on screen or default is one if you want scale two factors you can end the two drawing will scale up by two then if you want ununiform scale you can untick this here we have x and z so if you want y axis is two and x axis is one same as you can use first we can insert this difference file as scale one is to one then click ok here you can see the difference is added is you can see the difference between this drawing one and drawing difference the icon is changed my drawing is here next same as go here and attach drawing and same as drawing difference and click ok open here we have several options so i am going to untick this one and give the y value as two then click ok here you can see this is scaled up by two Go to difference, then click open. Go here. I am going to give this as uniform scale, or you can use both x axis is two and y axis is four. Then click OK. Here you can see the scale by two. Now we have all objects here. You can move this as normal. So click on it here and click on move. Then you can move anywhere. But these are one object. We can't work with this if you want to work with this right click and go to edit xref in place which is which means we can edit with this window so edit xref in place so click it here then click ok so you can't trim or any other things we can't do you can see here we can't trim so this is a reference file just we can attach to for reference and then we can develop our drawing same as click on here then go to attach image so i am going to this capture then click ok here we can place where i want then also i can insert the rotation so in this case i am going to insert the rotation as minus 90 degree then click ok here my image is pointing here so click on it here then i can adjust this key so in this case i'm going to use one is one then click ok here we have the image so you can use this image then you can draw here we can't see the difference between this so so click on this image then go here then you can adjust the fade so this image will change the opacity and also you can change the brightness and contrast if you want this is a large image if you want to clip this area click on create clipping boundary then i want to clip from here to this area so this is my difference so i can like guys we can work with here but you can adjust click on here this is a inverted value click in here this is a normal value so likewise we can use these image files as reference next one go to keep go here then attach pdf the same as so i am going to 
insert this image then click open same as image you can insert the images likewise you can attach the images drawings and pdf i hope this video is very useful please share with your friends thank you